good idea um, of the of the like, of the various teams that I feel like uh, we'll have more dialogue with than others. That being said, invariably every year things come up that we haven't really talked about before, and so you have to be prepared. You know, we've got uh, a far less. You know, we got far less to do this year than we did last year. Just by we're gonna have more continuity in our roster from last year, this year than we did from 2010 to 2011. So it allows us to kind of narrow the scope a little bit with what we're looking for, um, and just going through the dual process of the free agents and also the trade front to figure out, you know, how we can put together the best 25-man roster possible. Do you know? Uh, well, I'm sure you do. Um, is your budget changing much? Or about the same? Well, yeah, I think by now uh, you guys have a pretty good feel for the fact that, you know, we work within a range. Obviously, our resources aren't as plentiful as, you know, teams that we're competing against in this division, but, you know, we feel like uh, we'll be able to be creative enough to where, you know, we'll, we have a really good chance of fielding you know, an extremely competitive team next year. Are there a couple of goals? Yeah, we definitely, uh, you know, we need to figure out what we're going to do at DH. We have to figure out what we're going to do uh, at first base. Uh, beyond that, you know, potentially have a role for someone uh, on the bench if something fits perfectly. Um, and ideally a full pin arm or two. Speaking of DH at first base, can you update us on anything that's going on with Kotchman and Damon? It's similar to what, you know, we talked about. They're very much in the discussion. Um, you know, we have a responsibility to, you know, exhaust the different options and try to put together the best 13-man position player unit that we can that complement one another. Uh, they're very much in the discussion, and we're going through both on the trade front and the free agent front to see uh, what makes the most sense for us. How do you kind of balance that with the fact that they presumably have interests elsewhere as well? Is that is that kind of the moving quandary here? Or? Sure. I mean, it's you know, it, it gets to uh, the challenge of the off season, which is there are a lot of different factors uh, at play, um, and timing is everything. And uh, what we try to do is be as prepared as possible, have enough conversations going that we have a good feel for when it's time to jump on something and when you know, the, you know, playing things out is in our best interest to 